In the context of employment contracts, they will all be different. However, there are certain clauses that are common and standard to an employment contract. For example, some of these include the duties of the employer and the employees. This often includes the consequences for any actions and what constitutes a breach of that contract. The title of the employee, as well as the employee's job duties that go therewith. Whether the employee is part or full time. The employment terms, including whether an employee is at will or is to be employed for a certain period of time. Their pay, including the amounts, pay period, and any withholdings. Benefits, including insurance, paid time off, or 401k matching, vacation time, and the termination and severance clauses. Finally, we have the two most heavily litigated employment contract clauses, confidentiality and non-competition. As to confidentiality, it typically prohibits an employee from disclosing any proprietary information gathered by and through that individual's employee. As to confidentiality, those clauses typically prohibit an employee from disclosing certain proprietary information that that employee gained by and through their employment. Now, this can be anything from the means and methods of which the employer uses to engage their business to that employer's uh, customer list, vendors, etc. As to non-competes, these agreements restrict an employee from competing with and or soliciting the employees away from the employer. On the employer side, having an attorney is important to draft your contracts to ensure that they are done correct and are legally sufficient. That is, an employer cannot just create terms or use some magic words in hopes that their contracts will be enforceable. These contracts must comply with all state and federal law. Lawyers will know how to draft these specific contractual clauses to act in the best interest of the parties in the individual situations. For example, one of the most common issues that we see relating to these employment contracts relate to non-compete agreements. Often, these clauses are drafted by employers are too broad and are thus unenforceable, even if they are signed. Another important reason for employers to utilize employment lawyers is that the laws change. It's very important for an employer to have his employment contracts reviewed every couple of years at the latest to ensure that those contracts are still legal and enforceable. On the employee side, it is important to have an attorney to ensure that the employee understands the terms of the contracts and to have an advocate in your corner. In conclusion, today we provided a brief overview of the employment contracts and the practical effects of the terms therein. As demonstrated, it is vital to understand the terms and conditions that are made part of these agreements and the practical effects of the same. If you or someone that you know is faced with a business and or employment issue, we at the Sully Law Firm highly encourage you to seek counsel from a licensed professional. The Sully Law Firm would love the opportunity to serve you should these issues arise. We look forward to hearing from you.